I am joined by one of my lovely friends today. This is Sammy, Hi. and she has a YouTube channel called The Beauty Crush. It's one of my faves. I've mentioned it a couple of times before. We'll just take a side note moment for her hair. Okay? <laughs> like, serious hair crush over here. She's like, no. Oh. <laughs> no, honestly, I like lust over your hair in videos. It's lovely. She has a great vlog channel as well, which I'll link below because seeing her dog, it's just, I'm just watching him now. I think he's eating a shoe. Right. <laughs> Sammy has a great vlog channel as well, which I will link below, and we are about to film one of my favourite new series of hers. It's a girl talk series over on her channel, and it is going to be... <laughs> Sorry, the dog. <laughs> He's trying to eat everything come here, right come now. Here, come here. So we're going to film a Q&A on her channel. It's going to be one of her girl talk series. It's going to be all about boys and crushes mm -hmm. and relationships and that kind of thing. So I'll leave that link to that video below. As well as Sammy's channel, you guys have to check it out and don't forget to subscribe. Oh. But today, <laughs> this is like the longest interview of all time, <laughs> we're talking about our top 10 holy grail products. Yeah. Aren't we? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to let you start. You oh, go. Okay. So I'll start with skincare. Um, and this is something that, I, I don't know, I'm just in love with it. So before I started using this, I would use kind of more inexpensive cleansers and everything, just because I just didn't know a lot about them. But um, then I discovered this, and I just haven't left it since. It's the Shumura Skin Purifier. It has so many words, but it's a cleansing oil. <laughs> and I this one, oils. this one is especially for people that have slightly oilier skin, which is perfect because I get really oily skin down my T-zone and nose and everything. Um, and it's just so easy to use. You just pump it, put it all over your face, rinse it off, and yeah, it just like yeah. melts everything yeah. away, doesn't it? I used yeah. to use that one. I need to, I need to get back into it. It's I lit. just love cleansing oils, yeah. lazy girls, <laughs> yeah. heaven exactly. for removing makeup. My first one is an eyeshadow palette that I haven't. <gasps> this is so I want this. Vile, <laughs> but it's like the best eyeshadow palette of all time. It is so, so good. Like, the eyeshadows oh are so God. smooth. Like, <gasps> it's so, so buttery, soft. aren't they? Yeah. They're just like buttery smooth. <laughs> like, all the colors are so nice and like go so well together. They're just really good. It's like one of my favorite eyeshadow palettes ever. Oh my God. They're just saying something because yeah. I have way too many. <laughs> it's like softer than the MAC. Yeah. I love MAC eyeshadows, but and they're it's like, softer. Yeah, they're softer. Yeah. They're so buttery. So, my next Holy Grail item is a lipstick that I absolutely love. Sorry, this is my dog here. <laughs> Um, Holy. <laughs> thank you right in the nose and it's the mac brave lipstick and it was really difficult to choose between this <laughs> and russian red because i love both but on kind of for the everyday i love brave which looks like Let's this see. oh that's such a nice yeah, color it's so gorgeous i've it's, never seen brave before yeah Oh, it's, it's so um, nice. It's supposed to be another one that okay, like Kylie to, Jenner wears. This needs so. to happen. <laughs> don't eat Let me don't eat it. I think this one has become even more popular recently, but it's one that I've used for years and I've always repurchased and everything. And I think it would be amazing for all different skin yeah, tones definitely. and colours. Yeah, like it's really versatile. You love it so much. Are it's like coming to an end. end. Okay, I'm buying that. <laughs> end story. <No. laughs> so I have a recent edition. Actually, it's like in the past year, I've been like obsessed with lip liners. Mm, just to like too. make your lips look like more even and full and mm. bigger. My favourite one is the Charlotte Tilbury. It's so Ooh. grubby and gross. Charlotte Tilbury lip cheat and pillow talk. That looks really nice. And then nice. a really nice dupe is the Rimmel Exaggerate Lip Liner in East End Snob. I love that as well. It's so <laughs> good. Yeah. And they yeah. just make your lips look so much like more kind of mm. 3D. Yeah, they do. And yeah. East End Snob's really, it's quite soft as well for yeah. a drugstore lip, lip, um, yeah. lip liner. <laughs> okay, so my next Holy Grail item is the, oh, how do you say it? Is it Sesh Feets? I always I say <laughs> Sesh. I used to say Sesh. Seche Vite for some reason, but the Seche Vite um, Dry Fast Top Coat. This stuff is so, oh, it's so amazing. I don't like to wait around for long after um, painting my nails and I'm very heavy handed and it always yeah. smudges and everything. But when I use this, it, it makes them dry really fast, like it says. And glossy as well. Yeah, and it's so glossy and shiny and yeah, I just, I can't paint my nails without it. So I don't think it's very, very cheap, but it's not super expensive and it's worth the money. And it lasts ages as well. Yeah, it does. My third, is this third? Yeah, third is a foundation. And this is the L'Oreal True Match Foundation. Mm. Have you tried this? Yes, I'm I like, love Have this. you tried this? <laughs> it's so yeah. good, isn't it? 
isn't it? Yeah. It's just like a great kind of like foolproof mm -hmm. foundation. Like lasts really well on the skin, mm -hmm. gives really nice like buildable coverage, gives a nice kind of like glow that's not like a sweaty glow. It's yeah. just like a really yeah. good one. It's not too matte. I, I yeah. used this when it first came out ages ago. Really? Um, wow. That's yeah. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> and I still have some in my really? collection because oh yeah, I love yeah. it. It's, it's, really, it's really, really, really good. So my next product is the L'Oreal Super Liner Black Liqueur, and I just every single day I wear winged eyeliner. It's just you. Yeah, <laughs> I've got really addicted to it recently. <laughs> yeah, I'm so obsessed with it. I don't know why. I tried out quite a few different liners in my time, and I used to use the gel liner for a while. But sometimes when you, when you're in a rush, yeah, it's such a fast yeah, using the pot yeah. and the brush uh -huh. and the thing, and yeah. then like sometimes the pot dries out and then the brush dries out and, yeah right. but <laughs> but this is just it lasts for quite a while as well it's super black it's really easy to get a thin you know when you want to get the thin yeah. flick at the end um and it's quite it kind of like goes to a point yeah it's like, yeah it makes it easy it's real good kind of a lip product addict so i was like <laughs> this is just like the general category i feel like this is the category of lipstick for when you look like crap, you know? Like when you haven't had that much sleep and you want like a lipstick to a detract yes. from the bags and the gray and yeah. the sagging, you know? So I kind of like a good like illuminating red. So one I like Ooh. is the Charlotte Tilbury <gasps> red carpet red. I need that. Oh my, you can swatch. That looks so nice. It's so nice. <gasps> It's just like, and I they love, last so well. Yeah. And just, oh my gosh. The packaging, I love the Charlotte yeah. Tilbury packaging. Oh my as well. gosh, the packaging is so nice. <laughs> and, then, <laughs> and then I have one from Essence, which is in the shade 14. It's like That's a kind nice. of more pinky red. And then a more lighter, kind of like pigmentation oh, one from cute. the Body Shop, which is 15 Body Shop Color Crush. I love all of those. They're like my go to, like, when you haven't mm. slept and you want to detract from yeah. everything else that's going on, you <laughs> like know, big sunglasses. like a crappy hair day or something. <laughs> My next product, no, next and last product is the Bobbi Brown Corrector. And I feel like I'm repeating myself a lot because I do talk about this a lot on my channel, but it's just another thing that I can't go without. And if it's running out, like it's running out at the moment, I have to rush to Bobbi Brown and get another one. So I love this because I tend to get quite dark circles under my eyes. I just find that not many products work at combating it, but this really does. And it gets rid of the... Like veins. The, yeah, the the like the vein. Yeah, and the weird tones under the eyes. Um, and most of the time I use this on its own, just under my eyes, but you can also put a concealer on top. I also like the packaging because there's a little mirror in there. Yeah, it's so, so good they fit a yeah. mirror in there, isn't so it? So it's like, if you're traveling, it's really yeah. easy to use. My last one is like an illuminating blush. Ooh. I love good old like blushes that kind of act as like a semi highlighter yeah. as well. This is from Milani. I feel like it's about to break, you know, and you can just feel yeah. the packaging <laughs> like on its last leg. It's in the shade Luminoso. It's like a peachy with a kind of like golden shimmer in it. It's Gosh. just, yeah, it's so, so nice. Oh. <laughs> that is gorgeous. <laughs> Yeah, it's just Lovely. like a really beautiful colour. It's one of those like mm. illuminating cheek colours. It's a great one for summer as well. I love peachy yeah. um, blushes. Makes and you colors. look tanned if you're yeah. not actually tanned. Yeah. yeah it's good. <laughs> okay, so those are our top 10 holy grail items. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Yeah. Definitely go on over to Sammy's channel, watch the girl talk video we did, and subscribe if you're not already, because she is awesome. <laughs> <Thank> <laughs> Makes me laugh as you've done in love with this whole video. And yeah, we will see you soon. Bye! So, I am currently in Paddington Station on the way to meet my sister in Bristol, of all places. And I hadn't actually planned to do this this morning. This was like a really last minute, half an hour ago plan. But I am currently headed to the train, which is right here. And she actually is going to meet her friend 